Sean Pierce here. If you're watching this video, you want to know how to get rid of your piercing bump or your keloid. There's two different things, okay? Everybody thinks that a bump is a keloid. That's not correct. A keloid is a large bulbous lump that will happen years after a piercing is healed. A hypertrophic scar is a bump that occurs during the healing process of a piercing, okay? Those are easy to get rid of. A keloid, the only way you can get rid of a keloid is surgery, okay? Um, there's a couple ways to get rid of a hypertrophic scar, okay? A lot of people try tea tree oil that does uh, have a lot of positive results, okay? One thing that I've come to find um, that the results are fantastic, it'll get rid of it in just a couple days. You're going to go ahead and get yourself Neil Meds Wound Wash or you're going to get yourself Neil Meds Piercing Aftercare, okay? Now twice a day, what I want you to do is get a little cup. You're going to fill that cup up halfway, just like that. Now you're going to go ahead and warm it up. I don't want it super hot so it burns your skin, but you need to make it nice and warm. Okay, so stick it in the microwave for about 10 seconds. If it's too hot, just let it cool down for a minute. I recommend getting Q-tips that are just like this. They're compressed on the ends, okay? They make it a lot easier to compress the bump. What you're going to do is you're going to go ahead, you're going to soak these in this uh, Neil Med solution. Now, as you can see right here, on part of her industrial, she has a little hypertrophic scar forming. So you're going to take one Q-tip, hold it against there, and the other one against the back, and you're going to compress them, just like this. You're going to do this and hold it for two minutes. Now what that's going to do is that's going to soften up that bump. And within a couple days, as long as you do it twice a day, within a couple days, that bump will go away. These bumps are very, very common with the ears and with the nose, okay? Some people will get them on the belly button, not too many, but some people will. No matter what part of the body it is, make sure you do a warm salt water compress, okay? Um, you can go to any pharmacy, get Neil Med's Wound Wash, um, any supermarket. If you guys have any questions, any concerns, shoot me a message at underscore Sean Pierce. Until next time, take care.